Hello, good afternoon everyone. Today we're going to discuss an example on integration by parts. Let's start with following. So you have the first example here is to evaluate. You have your x cosine x dx. Starting to do that here. Yes, evaluate integral of x cosine x dx using integration by parts. So for the solution, we let u be equal to x. And dv be equal to cosine x dx. So that our du now is equal to dx. And our v, that is when we integrate dv, you will come up now with you remember the formula integral of sine is negative cosine. So I mean to say the integral of cosine is positive sine. So we have sine x. Therefore our UDV that is making use of our formula for integration by parts. Right, for the integral now of U D V equals U times V minus integral of v du should give us that should give us u which is x times v which is sine x minus integral of v which is sine x and then you have here du our du is dx This should give us x sine x. Again, what's the integral of sine? It's negative cosine. So you will have negative cosine x plus c. That should now be x sine x plus cosine x plus c. So that's actually the integral of your x cosine x dx. Integral of x cosine x dx. Now what happens if we have a different choice of our u and our v? Say what if we choose so note that if we let u to be equal to cosine x, let u be equal to cosine x, and our, say, our, this time, our dv is x dx, we will have du to be equal to negative derivative of cosine you remember derivative of cosine is negative sine so negative sine mm -hmm. x dx and our v when we integrate dv that now becomes x squared over 2 so, we will have integral of x cosine x dx becomes u times v. What is our u? This time cosine x times v which is x squared over 2. So, we will have x squared over 2 times cosine x 
plus okay, 1 half. We have integral of VTU. Our V is x squared over 2. And our du is negative sine x dx. So you'll have 1 half integral of x squared sine x dx. So the integral this time on the right is more complicated than the one on the than the one that we started with. So therefore this indicates that these are not desirable choices for you and for your TV. So it's very important that you know what you to choose and what DV to make use of. Otherwise, you might come up with a more complicated result. So therefore, this is the final answer, DV12. Integral of x cosine x dx is sine x plus cosine of x plus